good morning and welcome back to my channel. Today I am in Interlaken, Switzerland. Oh, I'm so excited. I'm going on a hike. The two girls that are with me are not going with me because they're going on a different hike. But my dad specifically uh, wanted me to come on this one because he came on this twice. And I've been on some of it when I was like a little girl. It's all up in the mountains. It's beautiful. I get to take a gondola up there. You'll get to see all of that today. So like stay around for the rest of this vlog because it's going to be like the most beautiful hike I have ever been on. I am beyond excited about this. If you're new, I have been traveling abroad this summer. I did study abroad in Greece and I just left Greece and now I have two weeks of free travel. This is Interlochen is his first stop. Subscribe and stick around for the rest of this video. myself guys so I could just uh, sit back and enjoy if you've ever done this hike it's called Fierst to Shingden Platt <laughs> I think that's how it's pronounced you go to Grindelwald and then you go from there to for Fierst first no I'm going to Fierst right now and then I'll start my hike and then I will take a cute little uh, it's like a trolley train thing back down the mountain I took that train when I was a little kid there's so many places that I'm seeing that I remember seeing when I was little and it's just like oh childhood memories I'm so pumped for this <laughs> Cow, cow. The cows are everywhere, all over the trail, and you can even hear them. Look at it. <laughs> I love it. get a picture with you. I just walked by this group. I'm pretty sure they were French. I think they were speaking French to me. They said bonjour. So one of the guys was playing the harmonica. And so I just kind of stopped and stood on the side listening and they were all singing along to the tune. And then they were just like, come on, come over here. But they were saying it in French. And so I went over there and I just stood and I hummed with them. I didn't know what the tune was. And then they played, oh, when the saints come marching in and one other, can't remember what it was, but American tunes because they knew that I was American. So it's just whatever he knew that was American. That was so sweet. I love running into people like that. That'll just, you know, welcome you in and just enjoy life with you because they're on this hike enjoying it. And this is the most amazing hike I have ever been on in my life. I mean, you could just see how green everything is. And the lake behind me. Guys, I'm not gonna lie. I am very tired right now. <laughs> I was on the easy part of the trail that is for everyone. And then it splits off and it goes where I'm going, which is the hard part of the trail. But it is so worth it because look at my view. And I doubt the camera does it justice because whoo, it's just beautiful. But I am tired, but that's okay. I climbed around Olympus. I can do this, right? <laughs> Look at that. Oh. There's 
Fullhorn, I think is how it's pronounced. That's my almost halfway point. <laughs> I have been hiking for about three and a half hours. Still going really good. It's still so beautiful. My favorite part right now is when I pass anybody, like no matter who it is, I say hello and I smile at them and they either answer hello in their language or they say hello to me, but I haven't passed a single American. So it always has an accent and I can tell that they either don't speak English or they have like a British accent or something like that. It's so cool because I'm passing like all these nationalities every few minutes and it's just a really neat experience because everyone says hello back and smiles even if it's in their own language and it's just awesome. <laughs> I'm on the home stretch guys. At least I think I am. <laughs> I think I've been hiking for f five hours now. I don't know. I'll tell you like the end of everything. I've had my Under Armour app going this whole time to tell me distance, how much I've climbed, how much I've descended, that kind of stuff. So I'll share that with you at the end. I had to put my scarf over my shoulders because my shoulders are burning. I did not think about wearing sunscreen. I have to be at the other place at a certain time because I'm catching the last like trolley train down. So I'm really trying to catch that because I really want to ride it. I haven't ridden it since I was like 10. And I really want to show you guys because it's really cute and it's so beautiful because you can see everything. So I'm about to book it and hope that I get there on time for that. Tired. I actually fell asleep on the way down because it was so like relaxing and soothing. My train's getting here so I am gonna get on and go back to Interlochen where we're staying. This is our last morning in Interlochen. We train out at like 2 or something. We're just here sipping our coffee and our tea. Knocking my spoon on the ground. Um, we don't really have any plans this morning. We're just gonna be souvenir shopping because I need a patch. You see this lovely sunburn I got yesterday? Like there's my camera strap and I have my backpacks and then like yeah. It was really bad. I didn't think about that. My ears so burned. We're just gonna like explore. We don't have any plans today, so it's great. <laughs> and interlocking. How has the trip been? It was amazing. It's been really good. It's been 
awesome. We had just like a chill day today. We just kind of walked around and talked and like, it was good. And we're about to get on a train to go to Salzburg. New day, new place, new vlog. So I'm gonna end it here. Make sure you subscribe and come back. We're going to Germany and we're going to Salzburg and Prague, Norway, Sweden. And Paris, we're finishing in Paris, so don't wanna miss that. Thanks for sticking around, guys.